Frank DeMora here with the last Chronicles of Planet Earth. Uh, yesterday as well, on that post of November the 2nd, 2011, I also talked about the Psalm 83 war and some of the signs that we're seeing from that. Now I'm going to scroll down here and show you a map like I did earlier today with the Ezekiel war. You'll see this map if you go to my site yesterday. This is a, a photo that uh, when I was in Israel, I took the photo. This is the East Gate that's still blocked off. Uh, this is another prophecy that will be fulfilled because the prophecy tells us that this wall, this gate, will remain closed, sealed up until Jesus Christ walks through this gate. He'll be the first one to go through it. But anyway, there's a list of all the nations that are going to attack Israel in the last days. And this is the Psalm 83 war. And you'll see the Hezbollah, the Hamas, the Syrians, the Lebanese, right? So let's find out, as I was talking today, about the possible attack against uh, Iran by the UK, the United States, and Israel. I want to show you what a poll, what the people in Israel believe about this possible attack on Iran and what will happen if they do this. You can see it today is November the 3rd, 2011, and let's go down here. It says, according to the, the uh, Heritage Dialogue poll, 59% of the residents say Iran attack would likely cause a regional war while 20 percent believe that the possibility of war is unlikely or entirely improbable so you have a poll that was taken in the middle east of the israeli people thinking that now there's 80 percent of these people in israel believes that they'll they'll go to war with who they'll go to war against the hamas and they will go to war with the hezbollah and when you read here, you'll also see it talks about Lebanon. A large majority of the Israeli citizens believe that the military operation in Iran will lead to a regional flare-up with the Hamas in the Gaza Strip and the Hezbollah to the north of Israel in Lebanon, the same nations that uh, God told us about in Psalm 83. So, and you can go down and read a lot more here, but I just wanted to point out very briefly that the people in Israel have a good inclination of what to expect, and they should expect it because this is what God has told us was going to take place in Psalm 83. So there's no reason to believe that it's not going to happen. The Psalm 83 war is near, and it will happen. Now, the scenario that brings it about uh, we're not entirely sure, but the strike against Iran could be one of those scenarios that may force the Psalm 83 war, of which Hezbollah, the Hamas, and Lebanon will be involved in along with some of these other nations.